Alright guys, what's up? And today I'm going to be showing you how to add a null light in um, Sony Vegas. Now I know there's a, there's a plugin for it for um, Adobe After Effects, but a lot of people don't know how to use Adobe After Effects very well and just want a simple null light um, to add to their videos. And this is a good way to do it. Um, now the one in After Effects is obviously a lot better looking, but uh, this is just a simple and fast way to do it in Vegas. So let's get started. Uh, what you're going to want to do first is open up your video in Sony Vegas, obviously. And you're actually, I have a clip with Twixter and Depth of Field, so I'm going to show you guys a final render of it. And what I want you to do is pay attention to the final render and not the Twixter slow mo or the little blurriness. So, yeah, what you're going to want to do is right click, uh, let me do select that, right click and hit insert new track, insert new video track. Um, and then after that, go to your media generators and your color gradient and drag in an elliptical black to white. And as you can see, just a color gradient of black to white just went over your video. Now what you can do here is click on the number two color and drag it from black to transparent. And as, as you can see, the white still stays and um, it is just a big thing in the middle of your screen. Um, and what I like to do is make it a little bit bigger. It's like that. And then you can go ahead and click on here and change the colors. Now, I think every, pretty much every color other than like a light yellow like this or a very light blue is bad other than a white. Um, a very, very light colors is what makes elliptical or uh, no lights look nice. Now, if I had like a dark purple, look how ugly that looks. So. Well, we're gonna, I'm just going to keep it as white and then close out of this and then go to your track motion over here and just go ahead and move this up into your top right screen and if you can see here I'll show you really quickly after I'm done with this okay as you can see here you can kind of see the lining of a box now there's no real way to get rid of that you can go ahead and uncheck maintain aspect ratio and as you can see it still stays so what you're going to have to do is click on your media generators and make it just a little smaller until it's gone. And as you can see, now it's gone. So um, the null light is still there, but it's just not as big. You can't make it huge or else it'll, uh, it'll just have that square and it'll be really ugly. So there we go. Now that you have your elliptical um, or your null light, sorry guys, you can go ahead and sync it to whatever part of the clip. Well, like maybe if you're slow mowing or something like that. So I uh, hope this helped, guys. Thanks for watching. Um, after this, you're just going to render it out, obviously. So thanks for watching, guys, and until next time, peace.